<laughs> All right, we're laughing because we're shy, but we got a new episode. It's a podcast. <laughs> All right, we're a little, I don't know why we're shy to do this. And I'm never usually shy to do these with anyone. But she's a little shy, so it's making me shy. And excited, though. Are you excited? Mm-hmm. <laughs> so we don't really have any real subject we're going to talk about. I don't really stick to subjects. I just talk. Some people stick to one subject the whole time. So let's, uh, what, do you want to in- introduce yourself? <laughs> I'm Ophelia. What was I supposed to say? <laughs> you say what year you were born? Mm, no. This is Ophelia. Uh, I, I live in Philadelphia, and she's from Louisiana, a country girl. Are you saying it's not the country? It is country, but it's not the country. Not the deep it's country. It's still a city. Oh, uh, my! I never was. I never was interested in geography. I used to be one of them kids that was like, "What's the point? Why do I need to know where this is? Ain't that stupid?" And history. I'd be like, "Why do I need to know what happened yesterday?" Were you like it? Mm-mm. You were never. Um, well, I'm gonna ask you. Just so everyone knows, how did we meet? Online, <laughs> at a bar. Facebook dating. Mm-hmm. And we met at we met at this bar across the street, and uh, that's it. And then we came here. How convenient! <laughs> and she was kind of shy like this. She was, and she's not shy like this off camera though. <laughs> Is this too urgent? Mm-hmm. Come on, babe. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, you're funny. So, what brought you to Philly? Can you get in a little? Because I, I, they might not hear you. Um, so what made you want to move from Louisiana, Lake Charles? Boredom. Boredom? Mm-hmm. Why? You like, what do you get, like, where you feel like you need excitement? I just wanted to go to a big city. So you never lived in a big city like that? Was it weird? Like, was it, how's it differ? Like, what's the difference? It's just much Ain't bigger. there streets and shit around there? Yes. It's not like dirt. There's no row homes. Houses are more spaced out. I the like whole city that. city like a suburb, kind of. You could start a band good there. Mm-hmm. Here, like, the neighbors will bitch. <laughs> there, it's spaced out. You could have a fucking band. Yeah. And you have to drive. Mm-hmm. No good public transportation. So we might move to New York. But I don't really want to, because t- New York's kind of crazy. Like, it's like... A lot of people, it's really expensive, it's congested, the rats are huge. Rats are huge. They're like damn squirrels. They're like, uh, they're like raccoons. Anyway, later in the podcast, we're going to make love. (laughs) (laughs) So stick around. Can we? Mm Mm-mm. See, what did you think when you first met me? Can you talk a little louder? Because I hope, I don't know, I I worry it might not be loud enough. Should I turn it up a little? Mm Mm-mm. So when you met me, all right, I walked up to you, and I just said, hey, uh, you want something to drink? (laughs) And you said, sure. You introduce yourself. You ask me if I want to get something to drink. Ask me what, and yeah. We sat down. I was making corny jokes that early, a little bit. Not really. What was I asking you? I wish I could remember. We were talking about Dahmer, the show, at first. Oh. Uh, how appropriate. <laughs> And then we came back here. After some hours. After a couple <laughs> hours. But I was like, I wasn't, I was shy. I wasn't that shy. I was shy in the very, very beginning, but it went away quick. 
And I couldn't. T- you didn't seem that shy. You seemed a little shy. Mm-hmm. I couldn't tell if you liked me or not. Right away, <laughs> until she did some, something. <laughs> <laughs> then I was like, "This girl's shy, but not shy at the same time. She's brave. She's brave, heart." Were you checking to see if it was little? Can you stop, please? Is that what you were doing, or you were just being perverted? I don't know, both. Uh, what if I just went? I would have went home. <laughs> we would have so, never talked to you, bro. That is a hypocrite. That is the me too thing. I don't know. All right. Anyway, <laughs> that's a little reverse discrimination, okay. but I welcomed it. Anyway, the next day, we, I don't know, after that, we've been pretty much glued since. Even when we fight. Even when we kill each other. That's not a good thing. (laughs) We'll stay together, like, mad at each other (laughs) instead of separating. That's my problem. But you want, she don't smoke, I smoke. I'm the country boy. She's from the country, but I'm... The country boy. <laughs> so how'd you start dating white boys? <laughs> what was the first white boy you ever dated? You are. No, it ain't. Yes. No, it's yes. not. <laughs> <laughs> Please, yes. What made you? No. I never dated no one else. Really? Black or white. Only <laughs> 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 She's lying. We, I wish that was true. It is. But if it made you who you are. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Everything makes you who you are. Mm-hmm. So uh, we got a little bit of plans today. What are we doing? We're going to the flower garden? Or are we going no, to the museum? we going to the museum. Thank you, God. And then we can go there. Because <laughs> it's like raining out. <laughs> who wants to look at flowers in the rain? It's 45 minutes away. It might not rain there. Well, <laughs> we went to a flower show once. Let's see. What, name all the things we did. We went, to, <laughs> babe. We went to a, in the order we did them. Okay. That's hard. We were supposed to go to that comedy show where we decided to sleep, so that doesn't count. One we time were we were so tired. She bought tickets to this comedy show like two hundred dollars, right? And we were lazy that day, and she was like, ah, fuck it, I'm just going to sleep. <laughs> I was like, babe, you paid. She didn't care. <laughs> I said, yo, we're going to Blue October. Can you get yourself your own ticket? And she did, and she don't even like them. And it was awful. <laughs> It was not that bad. Mm-hmm. She made me go to this rapper dude, Babyface Ray. He's a, he's not that bad. He ain't great though. He's okay. But I was nervous going because I was gonna be the only white boy. There were other whites. <laughs> not too many. <laughs> I, I what? Mm, really? Was not there? that many. There might have been, like, more white girls than white dudes. I didn't even see no white girls. Who am I kidding? (laughs) I'm sure there were some, though. That's how, in school, that's how I felt. Mm -hmm. When we, especially, like, in the morning when we go through the the metal detectors, like, it was just all black people. (laughs) I felt like the whitest little bits. But they never bothered me. Because I'm badass. Mm Mm-hmm. This is a real laid back podcast, guys. <laughs> My girl's a little shy. So, what'd you go to school for? I mean, what's your, like, you have a good career. What is it? I went to school for medical laboratory science, and I'm a medical technologist. Who? So I run tests in hospital labs. Is that science? Mm hmm. <laughs> And you like you put that in layman terms. I run lab tests in a hospital. 
All right, like say if I feel sick and I go to the hospital and they need to test my blood, you do that. Mm -hmm. And what other liquids? All of them. <laughs> Everything from a human body. Really? Yeah. Saliva, sperm, mm -hmm. what else? Throw up? Urine, feces. Throw up? If it, no, it's don't probably rare, that, though. No, unless you throw something weird at Oh, you. like you're looking for... All right. Damn, that's crazy. And you make bank. <laughs> no. When she first told me what she I made, don't. I was like, holy shit. I was like, sugar mama. Please stop. Sugar <laughs> mommy. <laughs> Please. Come on, sugar mama. <laughs> We're gonna clip that part out and make a real out of it. <laughs> I'm gonna make a real out of it. Show the people your pants. No. <laughs> she has these. <laughs> the, all right, I'll explain these pants. I never noticed them before. Like she said, it's what's in today nowadays. The front is black, and then when she turns around, it's jean material. But there's like a thong of the black jean part caught out so it looks like you're basically wearing a thong or it looks like <laughs> your underwear are over your jeans <laughs> but it's kind of it reminds me of two-faced a little show them what i mean you don't want to you don't have to <laughs> google it guys say two-tone jeans <laughs> who the hell is gonna google that <laughs> fabrizio <laughs> Uh, Fabrizio, you better not be Googling that, you pervert. <laughs> uh, guys, I'm in love. <laughs> we just make a good team. Why do you think we make a good team? We're different. <sighs> Some would say that's a bad thing. I think we're good friends, so we make a good couple. No. Like, we would, like, be, say if we never dated and we met as friends, we would definitely get along cool as shit. Like, we would be calling each other, yo, you believe this fucking bitch did this shit to me? Mm -hmm. And you'd be like, damn, how the fuck did that? You, you don't think we would be good friends mm -hmm. before we dated? No. I think, yeah, because we both got those <laughs> fucked up attitudes. especially That's when, why we wouldn't be good friends. Yeah, we would. <laughs> Yeah, but we would agree with a lot of shit, I think. We would agree with more shit as friends than we do as relationship people. Because we, we wouldn't be so like, what do you mean by that? We wouldn't take it so personal. <laughs> yeah. I still would. Because <laughs> you would have a crush on me. Maybe so. Guys, she didn't, you guys might be watching this saying she probably was more attracted to your neater look when your hair was nice and gelled and you look slick. She likes the more rugged look. When I shaved, she didn't like it. When my hair was neat, she didn't like it. She's basically trying to turn me into like a crust punk. You like that crust look? Mm -hmm. If it still looks clean. I think my crust look looks real. There's some dudes that go for the crust look, but they still look like clean boys. They can't, it ain't in their blood. Does that make sense? It does. <laughs> Guys, we're just getting lazy. We need to smoke another blood. But yeah, man, ever since I met you, I've been really close to you. Same. You're kind of like the love of my life. <laughs> You're the love of mine. Mommy. <laughs> <Suck>. <laughs> Guys, don't unsubscribe, please. <laughs> this is true love. I don't know what it is. Some people say, like, what is love? What is love to you? I don't, I don't know. To me, it's kind of hard to describe. You just know when you're in it. You just know when you're in it. Mm -hmm. Like we all been with people where we it felt empty and bleak <laughs> and desolate. <laughs> <laughs> Joker. <laughs> Guys, one time we were arguing and saw it, and I was talking like emo and depressed, <laughs> and 
And I said saw, and I was like, all my life I had to fight. And she said, okay, Joker. <laughs> <laughs> or Batman. I forget what the hell she said. Uh, we say the funniest fucking jokes. I can't even think of them right now. <laughs> Uh, one time I was, she was getting out of her car and she was dressed kind of sexy, and I was like, "Babe, that's that's kind of revealing. You should sh you should take that off." And you and she was like, "You want me to?" And she pretended to pull her <laughs> pants. <too. laughs> I was like, "No." <laughs> You're funny as shit. You're the funniest person I know. Mm. I don't really know that many funny people. Rat. Are any of your friends, like your people, your exes, anyone, are they goofy like me? Like, take say cringy jokes and shit? None, no one? They say cringy shit, but they're not as goofy as you know. They're silly. Nobody? You're the silliest person I know. <laughs> wow. That's crazy. It's cute. I think that's one of my not to boast. I think that's one of my good parts of me. I think so. That's why, that's literally like, Will, if you watch this, that's why Will likes me. That's why Dave liked me. That's why Tyrone, that's why motherfuckers like me. <laughs> Guys, when I saw this shirt, I don't usually like concert t-shirts. Metal bands, they make some ugly logos, but this shit like popped out to me. I was like, that shirt's banging. There was like 30 shirts. This one was the only one I noticed. She got one too. She bought us them. Stop telling people that shit. <laughs> that blood bank <laughs> money. Stop. Yo, that's my next band name. Remember that? Blood bank money. That's a hot name for a metal band. <laughs> we are blood bank money. That's good, Will. <laughs> that's how ideas, like... Artists, when I, they always just keep a pad with them and shit pops in their head throughout the day and they write it down. Eminem does that. Comedians do that too. Jokes even more so because they, they're just so random. I have, I could write books of stand-up with all the jokes me and her told each other and I fucking okay. never write them and she never reminds me of what they were. All right, so you guys might know we both have tattoos of each other. She has my name. I have her name. What made you do that? I'm dumb. <laughs> <laughs> I did it because I love you. Same. It's a dumb reason, but here we are. I think it's a good reason. Mm -hmm. What's more important than love? <laughs> when I say life's about love, I don't just mean people loving people. Like, ooh, someone could love money, but it's still love. Like, I love fucking money. Life is about love. It, name one thing and I'll find a way to make it about love. Life is about love, I agree. <laughs> but you need the down parts. Mm -hmm. Or you would never, like, imagine if it was always happy. You wouldn't even be able to tell it no more. I wouldn't trip either of us. I know, I would love it. <laughs> I love my happy days. I get in these spurts where I want to be like real positive and be nice to people, da da da. That always lasts like three days and then it goes away. I fucking hate everyone. Is that everyone or is that just me? Are you like that? I'm pretty neutral all the time. Really? Yeah, but you never wake up crabby like the wrong. No. I don't. Well, you I... No, I don't. She might have. <laughs> no. Ophelia is the sweetest girl in the world, but do not get on her bad side. Because she will go Queen Latifah on your don't ass. Don't say that. That's corny as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> no, I will not. <laughs> Show the pants. No, man. <laughs> show your pants and I'll show mine. I just got plain black ones on. Let's see. Mm-mm. Okay, then. 
This is a chillin' ass podcast. I like it. Guys, we're not, this isn't, <laughs> see, this is more us hanging out. I'm not really interviewing her, we're just talking. This is how we talk when we're just together. We're not acting, we're not really, we're not putting a show on, basically, is what I'm saying. You can end it. <laughs> you can end it. So, I will say this on here, that one day I hope to marry you. <laughs> and yeah. You too. Mm-hmm. Okay, mommy. <laughs> Let's do it. Babe. Let's get married. <laughs> we can get married, mommy. Uh, wait. There. Oh, uh, uh, all right. I'll tell. Can I tell a joke that what? happened to us? Is it a little bad? What is it? The what? The head is joke. I don't remember. You called me a head is, and I was like, "You're the head." Is. I guess. All right, so <laughs> we were watching YouTube or whatever, a movie, and sometimes we lay in weird ways. And she was laying with her face, like, kind of right near my ass. And she always calls me head ass. Like, it's like her name for me, head ass. And something, something, and she was like, she called me head ass. And I was like, me? You're the head ass. <laughs> Because her head was near my ears, like pretty much in my ears. <laughs> she like, oh lord, <laughs> why do I tell these? Stop. It's a very fearful thing <laughs> to have someone down there, but facing your fear is kind of exciting. That's why they gotta just start making bidets everywhere. Why is that only in France or whatever? Bodets. What are they called? Bidet. Yeah, like I used to think that was weird, but really it's weird to just wipe your ass with paper, <laughs> dry paper. How is that smear clean? Smear the shit off. Just smear it off. <laughs> and then leave little balls of toilet paper. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Every podcast I do goes to like, it always leads to talking about shit. Your fetish. <laughs> we do got some fetishes. No, we don't. We're very plain. I'm joking, guys. This is a PG podcast. Oh, no. Horrible. That horrible girls. They We're talk. not them. She listens to this podcast called Horrible Decisions. These girls talk crazy. I How do they make any money? They go on tour and they sell merch. But I think YouTube would demonetize them for the way they talk. So they probably don't make much YouTube money. I don't think you're allowed to talk real crazy on YouTube. I don't know. YouTube's getting a little more lenient. Like you could, like there's some nasty shit on there. Not as bad as Twitter, though. <laughs> or Reddit. So we might be together forever. <laughs> Angelo. She does this thing where she pinches me and it makes me scream <laughs> in public. But it's funny as shit. It hurts, but it's so funny. Because <laughs> it's like a shock. <laughs> oh, don't do that again. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> we gotta delete this. I can... Yeah. No, because I'm never gonna be able to... If we ever break up and I watch this again, it's going to break my heart. Aww. Because we're just funny together. We can just be together. Some people can't just be with. Can't be you with. Mm-hmm. So who's your first white boy you dated? Angela. The first white boy you ever encountered? <laughs> <laughs> Never seen one. 
<laughs> so Angelo. <laughs> and what'd you think? What is that? Wow. I want to be with him forever. <laughs> Really? First white person. She didn't actually like how I looked when she first met me because I had my hair real oh, neat yeah. in gel and I wore like fucking Versace. <laughs> I'm joking. I wore it. spray Axe. Probably was Axe, right? It's hot. Why would I use that? It's the shittiest spray. Anyway, since we met, we've been glued at the hip. And that's it. We got to get going, guys. We got to walk Hell Max. Yeah. Do you want to tell the people anything? Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on. sorry. Baby. I love you. I'm sorry. For what? <laughs> We're not talking. <laughs> I talked the whole podcast. <laughs> sorry. You're so shy. <laughs> Guys, she really... All right, can I ask you a question? Yeah. <laughs> what happens to you when you get shy? You, you clam get up? Anxiety. What are you thinking about? About how shy I am? That's the only thing I think about. <laughs> I don't get shy like that. I, get I know. Sh I get shy like if I'm talking to... S or I used to get shy like this. If I'm talking to someone, I'll talk kind of low... And then we're... When? I'm talking that. I mean, like, even a dude. Any, or ordering no. pizza, shit like that. No. Not anymore. I said not... Oh. <laughs> I was gonna say. YouTube kind of broke me out of my bubble a little. Mm -hmm. And just working around men for years. And da 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 And you broke me out of my cell a little. I go out in shorts with flip-flops <laughs> on. I don't go far, but I go meet her down the block. I would never do that. You have to be fully dressed. I wouldn't be wearing no fucking swords. With, I mean, with flip flops. <laughs> I feel like I'm not really dressed if I'm wearing flip flops. Anyway, guys, what else could we talk about? <laughs> oh man. So you're, you want to go back to school, right? Mm-hmm. What are you thinking of doing? Um, I don't know yet. <laughs> Pharmacist? That's what I've been considering recently. I think, but don't they, like, make, like, the same as what you make? Maybe a little bit more. Dollars. You're going to go. <laughs> so... Why would you do it? It would all... be nice to have the option to do something else. Well, I'm just saying, like, why I do all... this? I guess. But that's a lot to do just for a couple extra bucks. It's only like two or three years of school. You're determined. <laughs> I've always been scared. I don't know why. Because I'm a pussy. I was so shy in school. If I was. If I was me now, how I am now, back then, I would have did better in life. I was shy as shit back then, so, like, right when I could leave school, I didn't want to go back to it. You were shy? Like, of the people? I just, I don't know, I just was real introvert. Outside of school, like, at I home. I was introverted at school. Yeah, but I wasn't, like, a brainiac either. I was, so it made it, like... I had no interest. It's hard to force yourself to be interested. In what school has to offer? The, like, the subjects in school you were interested in that? Not really. You like English, To me, I'm it's sure. like work. You like writing. I like writing. You don't even realize you're really learning, but then, like, you do use... Write words for the rest of your life. But at the time, it feels like you're... I ain't gonna remember this shit. <laughs> Algebra, you never have to use after school. Yes, you do. Skip it, guys. <laughs> I never used it. Maybe a very... What are you, a plumber? Why do you use it? Like, I don't know. I'm trying to think of, like... 
Like, I'm trying to think of, like, how much I need to save in order to get to a certain amount, or... Use the algebra for that? Yeah. Like, oh, if I save 200 per week, how many weeks will it take for me to get to 5,000 or some shit? Yeah. It's for basic shit. You do use it. You just don't notice it. (laughs) 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 Or if I smoke one pack of cigarettes a day, how how much would that cost me a week? Like, I just you know, do it the thing. slow way. That's still algebra. I do like. Or the, like, damn, I'm spending three hundred a week seven. on cigarettes. How many packs am I smoking? Like, it yeah, makes life simpler. Well, I'm still retarded. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, Papa. <laughs> Dude. Ugh. Can we really go out? All right, guys. I'm a little worried going out with her because these pants look like a thong. And I do not feel like fighting no motherfuckers today. They're not that bad. It, They're not bad, but they're, your eyes are going to be drawn right to the ass because that's where the thong part is. It's not really it's not a, thong. a thong. It's not a thong. It's jeans with a black, like, uh... Tracing of a thong. What's the word I'm looking for? Outline. The outline of a thong. Maybe. You ever see, you ever see people with yoga pants that's like exactly the same color as their skin? And you're like, are they fucking naked? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that shit is crazy. Are they trying to look naked? Ew. Maybe. They some hoes. All right, guys, I think we're going to end the podcast here. I kind of got to charge my phone if we're going to go out. We don't have no guards. Um, and hey, now. <laughs> Show the pants, baby. For real? Yeah, you might as well. I'll put it back so it don't look like you're just showing your boots. <laughs> These are the pants we keep talking about. Uh, they're not that dirt. They are a little dirty. People are going to look. They're not too crazy. People, I will be fist fighting. <laughs> All my friends, I hope you didn't screenshot that so you can whack off later. I will come to your house <laughs> and kill you. Those are some hot jeans, though. But they your will get some hot. looks. Your jeans get looks. <laughs> You guys want to see my jeans? No. Come on, please. <laughs> Come on. It's just on. jeans. <laughs> they don't have a look. Come on. <laughs> Hell yeah. Uh. <laughs> Chill. That, those people are looking in. Mm. <laughs> this is a fun podcast. If you is guys, really? if you guys like Ophelia one here, let me know in the comments, and maybe we'll make her do it every week. If this video gets 10 likes. <laughs> no. <laughs> I got to make 10 different <laughs> YouTube accounts. <laughs> and like my own video. Oh, God. Wait, Mac. All right, guys. We got to go walk this <laughs> mongrel. Don't fucking call him that. Stop. All right, guys. I love you. We're out. Are you going to say bye? Bye. <laughs> do that thing you do. Hello. Hello. <laughs> do it okay, again. No. Do it again. No. One more time. Come on. One more time. Not... No. You didn't do it's it right. Genuine. You didn't Stop. do it right that time. Hello. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> How are ya? Stop. <laughs> All right, we're a cute couple. Fuck you guys. I'm joking. Hit the like. And uh, we're going to say bye. You going to say bye? Bye. Bye, guys. (laughs) Subscribe.